All right. If you stumble on any new tech, you know who to bring it to. Sure. Have you talked to the others recently? I've been trying to get a moment with them, but things are still so busy. Seems our time slots never align. Uh, as a matter of fact, they just sent me to come get you. Then it's my lucky day. Come with me. All right. After you. Hold on, I want to see why I'm over encumbered. Hailstorm. <gasps> oh, cool, dude. Night. You'll want to hear this. I picked up oh. a low frequency What's going signal on? in the area. It's weak, but I'm close to narrowing down the coordinates. If we can find and boost the source of that signal, we might be able to use it to get in touch with California. That's excellent news, Scribe Valdez. Follow up with me as soon as you have the coordinates. What's this about? I thought I made it clear that our first priority is strengthening our presence in Appalachia. My apologies, Paladin. The Knight kept talking about Elder Maxon's orders, so I set up a signal tracer to run in the background. It was my own initiative. This isn't a field trip, Paladin. When we left, Elder Maxon ordered us to restore communications as soon as we arrived in Appalachia. You've delayed that order long enough. That's interesting. Since our arrival, every last ounce of my effort has gone toward establishing the Brotherhood as an effective force of action in Appalachia. Everything we've done here has been necessary. And before Valdez's report, we had no leads on a long-distance communicator. We would still have no leads if it were up to you. Enough, Shin. We have a lead now. Let's focus on that. You said you're close to tracking down the signal, Valdez? Why don't we have our reliable initiate assist you? Okay. I'll be in my workshop when you're ready. Or you could just talk to me now? Sorry you had to see that. Let's get down to business, shall we? If we can find the source of the signal I detected, we should be able to use it to send a message to Elder Maxon on the West Coast. I tracked the signal to an area northwest of Vault 76. You'll need to go and check it out in person. Maybe you'll get lucky. But I suspect the source of the transmission won't be easy to find. Devices that transmit at this frequency are rare. The only ones I know of were built at advanced military facilities. Okay, okay. Is that all you guys say? <laughs> Alright, let me see. Uh, you said the signal was weak. Would it still work? I'm glad you asked. It may not work in its current state, but... Do you remember what we found in the Atlas substructure? An incredibly powerful compact ultrasight battery cell. With one of those, we could easily boost the transmitter back to its full function. Lucky for us, I've just managed to reverse engineer the cell. Good. Think of this as its final test. That's good. That's really good, actually. Uh, why couldn't we use some other transmitter? Because other transmitters don't reach that far. The one they were using at Fort Defiance is out of commission. Permanently. But low-frequency signals, like the one I'm detecting... They travel incredible distances, even passing through mountains and oceans without a hitch. <coughs> During wartime, they were used to transmit signals to submarines. <laughs> Pretty cool, right? Yeah. Really is. I think that's actually possible, too. Uh, probably... Probably not the greatest connection, though, but... Um, let me see. So why is Shin so... Uh, concerned uh, about contacting Elder Maxon. It was one of our orders. After setting up in Appalachia, we were to reestablish contact, make a report, and receive our next assignment. So it's then, not that the Paladin has directly disobeyed that order, but she's been more focused on helping Appalachia. Being in that position as the leader of this whole operation, I can't even imagine how much she has to think about. I'm just trying to support both her and the Knight as much as I can, and hopefully get them back on the same page. Okay, so that's very interesting. I wonder why Paladin uh, Ramadi, Ramani is, why they're butting heads so much. What's After up with them anyways? Done for us, I suppose you deserve an answer. Their why, yes. Their relationship has been rocky since a certain incident on our journey here. It's kind of a sensitive topic for everyone. 
I thought they'd be able to work things out over time, but it's only gotten worse. I'm honestly kind of worried. But maybe contact with Elder Maxon will get them back on track. I hope it does. I mean, if that's the orders, that's what we need to be doing. Um, all right, I'll find the transmitter. Stay safe out there. We'll be right on your tail. Yes, ma'am. So we've spoken with her. We need to be up, updating our quest. Look at the transmitter's facility. Let's go to data and do it this way. Oh, I know exactly where that's at. That's... Where should I go? Probably best if we go here and then go north because we're going to spawn right around this area anyways. Oh, no, I can't fast travel. So let's see if we could find a workbench. This works right here. I need to scrap a bunch of stuff. Like these laser weapons. Um, And that... I'm keeping that for now. I want to check it out. Don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need that. Or that. Or that. Alright, good. But that, I just noticed that I didn't put on my outfit. So let's go ahead. We should be able to fast travel now. At least I hope. Um, alright, let's fast travel. 38 caps. You're killing me. You are absolutely killing me. Luckily, this shouldn't be too far of a run. <clears throat> I'm very curious. Dude, I'm pretty sure this is going to be like a civil war situation towards the end. Like, Paladin Romani and Knight Shin's conflict, I guess you could say, seems a little bit more than just, uh, I guess, a conflict of ideas. It kind of seems to me like their beef is a lot deeper than that, you know? Like, fundamentally different in their philosophies or worldviews. I would say... I would say uh, Night Shin is more traditional brotherhood. And Ramadi is more... How should I say? Uh, oh, God. Get away from me. Ah! Oh my god, he's dead. So we found the... Tr this door is new. This used to be regular open. Alright. Uh, what's going on? Uh, hi? Dude, we're going into an Enclave facility. Are we also starting the first beef between the Enclave and the Brotherhood? That'll be nuts. That would be really nuts. And I like it. I doubt it's going to go that deep, though. Explore the facility? I should probably keep my weapon out. What's my weapon's durability at? Oh, it's still it's still good. Task one five one nine seven seven. Sodas. <laughs> Lower temperature to twenty degrees Celsius in the lab. Task complete. Please verify. Task queue interrupted. It seems as though we have a visitor. Welcome to Enclave Research Facility Site J. May I ask the reason for your visit today? Uh, I wanted to order a large number three. Uh, let me see. 
We detected a transmission coming from this facility. We need to access your transmitter. Interesting. Not like the others. <clears throat> Very well. Task entered. Estimated wait time, 14,320 hours, 12 minutes. Okay, sounds good. But first things first, I'm actually the general of the Enclave. I demand you to give me access now. Affirmative, general. Priority adjusted. New estimated wait time, 6,598 <laughs> hours, 42 minutes. Oh, God. That's terrible. Is there any other way to get uh, gain access? You may manually activate the transmitter via the communication center. However, I do not recommend that. It is a Why? Very long walk. Um. In the meantime, if you wish to tour the facility, please enter decontamination to your left. Okay then, decontamination to my left. That looks bad. I had a feeling it was radiated. What does this do? Oh, I don't have access. I mean, I, let's just let's just do this. I'm not trying to get heavily irradiated right now. There we go. Excuse me. Coming through. Hold on. There's a button right here. Maybe I could just open it this way. Bam. Can I turn that off? No. All right, whatever. Let's go. Task one five one nine seven eight R Wiggins. Turn on the goddamn light in the <laughs> Task complete. Whoa! What's Please going on here? Verify. This is a trip, dude. What's going on? I'm so confused. Got some Myler Kings. A giant mole rat. Biological hazard detected in the research lab. Uh oh. Please evacuate immediately. Oh god. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. It's just that simple. Look at that. Oh my god. Do I have to fight him? Ah, get away from me. Do I have grenades? I have a cryo mine. Oh man, it didn't work. All right, well let's go with a regular cryo mine. Oh snap! Oh man, he made me waste it. Ow! Where'd he go? Happy birthday. Oh, dude, he destroyed me. That thing destroyed me really bad. Alright, well, let's go back in there. I want, I want him. He's gonna die whether he likes it or not. I just need to remember how to get there. I think it was this way. Yes. Because this is where he came in. Oh, God. Happy birthday. Ah! Don't hit me! I wonder how much damage this does. Aw, oh, man. Where'd he go? Oh, God. Am I tripping or did that actually do a lot of damage? Get away. Oh, snap. I gotta hide for a second. Can you be nice? There we go. Oh, I'm out of ammo already. All right, let's go back with the slug buster. Oh, snap. Get in there. 
Come on, baby. He's scary, dude. Do I have any grenades whatsoever? I have a pulse mine. Ah! Oh, God. He's scorched, too. All right, I want that mine back. No! Run! Let's go! For Narnia! Got him. All right, I want that pulse mine back. Sure, I'll take that. And that, and that. All right, so what am I supposed to do now? He's dead, so... Is this insinuating that... The Enclave created all this? Feed the giant moth subject before it gets upset. Error. Moth subject missing. Yeah, moth subject is dead, homegirl. I hear a lot more things, though. And it's a little unsettling. How am I supposed to get out of here? I'm so confused right now. Here, maybe? Well, it says explore the facility now. Task What's going on? Zero, zero, unknown user. Priority one. Open all Let's go. Cell doors in the holding cell area. Oh God, this is going to go bad. Oh snap. Where are they going to come from? Man, I really wanted to use that on the the Wendigo. Come on. Oh, this is bad. How did he not die? So I need him to die. Come on. Dunzo. Whatever it is I'm looking for, that just makes me pretty sure that we're getting close. So let's continue exploring. All right. We're on the right track. What is that? Oh, it's a mole miner. Come on. Oh, no. Oh, God, not cave crickets. Run. Oh, God, I'm actually kind of running low on ammo. Oh, snap. That one rad rat, I mean, uh, ant needs to die. You! Die, please. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Perfect. Luckily, he was walking very slow, so chances are... Chances are he was just, he, was, he had like a broken limb or something. In here? What what en enemies are we gonna find here now? One five one nine eight one K Jones. Increase barometric pressure in holding cell two C to twenty four hundred millibarts. Error. Unknown term. Millibarts. <laughs> Please resubmit task. Oh snap! So where are where are we supposed to go? I'm so confused right now. Oh god. Oh, God. You have got to be kidding me, dude. I'm so gonna die. And I got no... Run! 
Oh, I'm so screwed. Run away. Come on, baby. We got this. Just stay there. No, stay there. Oh, snap. Run away. Maybe if I just play a ring around the rosy. Get away. Get away. Stop being so rude, Deathclaw. <laughs> this is funny. Dunzo. That was good. Radium rifle? Sure, why not? Just something to scrap. What is that? Where'd you come from, bro? You need to chill out for a second, right? I'll be taking that. Uh, sure. And let's destroy all the stuff that we just got like this. And that. And that. Man, all right, let's go. So she's dead. Holding cell key card. Um, I'll let you guys read that. At a later time. At least we got the key card. Wonder where this leads. So is this finally the way out? I get the feeling she did it all. Also, I only have 143 rounds, so I hope I don't find any tough enemies. Gross. Everyone's dead. That's disgusting, dude. What is this? Oh my god, is that pink paste from Fallout 4? Is this even the way I'm supposed to go? Please forgive the mess. The residence became rather unruly. Oh crap. Die! Good. Good. We're, we're doing good. Come on, baby. Just stand still. Please die. Ah! Come on, baby. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. That's... It's no longer good. And now it's good again. Get away from me. I'm running dangerously low on very expensive ammo. I love it when they blow up. Dunzo. Can you stay still? I'm trying to kill you, bro. Got him. One left, right? Dunzo. Thank God for healing factor. Ooh, yes. Ignoring. Sure, why not? I'll take all of it. Why not? Sure. Shock baton, don't need any of that. So, oh God, more. Oh, this could be bad. They sound so stupid, don't they? Ah! Get away! Oh, God. Why is this guy so tough? Love it. I wanted to avoid if he was just, just going to die by... 
slowly, you know, burning to death, but no, I, it wasn't gonna happen. Come on, baby. Oh my god, how many are there? Oh god, I need I need to heal. Can I get my fixer? I only have six rounds with a fixer. And I don't have missiles. Oh, dude, I don't have enough. Ammo's an issue right now. As in, I have no more ammo. That is not good at all. I still have my Grognax axe. Get out of here. She's literally trying to kill me, dude. Rude. Alright, well, I'm pretty sure I could take them all out with my Grognax axe. Because I'm pretty sure these guys have very little to no armor. So I should be fine. You! Oh, I missed. Get out of here. Dude, I'm about to be overweight, aren't I? Alright, where are we going? It still says explore the facility. You! Give me that plasma stuff. I don't know where he went. He's literally gone. Is this him right here? Thank you. Alright, look. Check it out. Happy birthday. Sick. Alright, whatever. Let's go. You! Happy birthday. Hey, you have nothing... Nothing worthwhile. I'm just gonna press on. Hey, you! Warning. I just wanted to say hello to you. In area. Security, Dude, this Grognax axe, axe is pretty effective. Mainly because these guys have no armor whatsoever. What the hell? Why is he in power armor? Die! Oh god, run away. Run away. No! No! Oh god, dude, I'm gonna die. Luckily, I have an, like a million... I'm gonna take another one. Whoops, that's not what I wanted. Go! Come on, baby. Where'd he go? Alright. We're, we're doing good. If I could get that other scorched guy, not the power armor dude, to come. Alright, fuck it. Oh, I got no... No! God, this dude is strong. He should die with one more hit. Got him. You, get out of here. Wow, that was tough. I'll take that plasma ammo, though. Does any of the guys up here have plasma? Yes. I think we're good. So there was a terminal or something that I saw right here. Okay, so it is a terminal. Let's go ahead and find out what this is about. Uh, White Spring. All right, C uh, Enclave. Air transmission stable by mainframe. Please contact administrator for assistance. Custom encoding. So the, I'm assuming this is. The robot sodas or whatever her name is. 
Uh, administration control. Very nice. Warning, uses of the uh, of this administration console is restricted to members of HR and executive officers only. That would be me. Uh, please register handprint with the register. All right. Handprint. Registration successful. Thank you. Uh, return to lobby. I think I could do that. I'm going to go out on a limb and say it's this way. Dude, please tell me I have the materials on me to fix my weapon. Uh, inspect repair. Workbench, yes. Great. Let's uh, go back to that weapon because, let's be real, this is my baby right here. Nice. Wait, okay, so I'm in the lobby. What does that mean? Who the hell is this? Oh, it's the Brotherhood. It's Paladin Ramadi. Hey, Paladin Ramadi. Um. Oh, no. Don't crash, please. Come on, server. Don't do this to me. I think it's going to crash. I'm almost certain of it. Oh, it didn't crash. All right, let's try to talk to them again. There's no time for conversation. Soon you'll see the importance of this mission. Now isn't the time. All right, well, let's try to talk to the robot then. Um... I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Warning. Visitor has accessed mainframe. The others tried to shut me off too. Uh oh. Their task failed. As will yours. What is that voice? It doesn't Are they following me? Task zero zero zero. Unknown user. Oh snap! What the hell is that? Oh, he's not that strong though. Get away from me, dude. Run away. The initiate failed to mention there was still a homicidal AI trying to guard this place. Nothing we couldn't handle. Why am I still running? <laughs> Alright, well now that he blew up, let's see what he has. I'll take all of that. That, 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 that. I don't want the fusion core. I'll take that to destroy that. Vampire's ultra sight. I mean, it's. Well, that's not fair. The freaking robot disappeared. Before I got to claim my item. What in the world just happened? All right, whatever. Robotti. Appears to be a manual console for the transmitter. I need a moment to figure out the controls. The two of you are to find the power supply and install the ultrasite battery cell that Scribe Valdez sent us with. Uh. We'll go install the ultrasite battery then. Take your time. I'll need to wrestle with this device for a while. I don't know how Scribe Valdez does it. This way, Initiate. I believe the power supply should be in this area. Will do. Right behind you, sir. Let me check the, uh, oh god, we're probably gonna need to fix our weapon again soon. What are we doing? Let's get this done quickly. Leaving Romani to fiddle with the transmitter as she pleases doesn't sit well with me. Okay. Um. That's your superior. It's against everything I know and trust to disrespect my superiors. But it would be irresponsible to hold back my reservations any longer. Paladin Romani's actions are unbecoming of her station. She carelessly shares resources, takes unnecessary risks, and doles out her trust to anyone who takes an interest in joining us, regardless of merit. The brotherhood she's building is not the one I believe in. Um. See, I, I mean, I can see where you're coming from, but... Uh, her heart is in the right place, don't you think? It 
doesn't matter where her heart is. There are no buts in a life or death situation, Initiate. Paladin Romani is responsible for the lives of dozens of Initiates and countless civilians. One wrong choice for them, and that's it. I won't argue about this, but I will order you to get back to the transmitter while I finish up here. Think about what I said, Initiate, and think about what the Brotherhood stands for. Honestly, I'm not even sure why I came. All right, that was 100% uh, pointless. All right, what's up? Did Night Shin get held up? Well, perhaps it's for the best. This gives me the opportunity to ask you something. You've been a tremendous asset to the Brotherhood's efforts, and I'd like you to continue to be one. But we can't do that with the shadows of the Elders looming over our shoulders. What does that mean? Too obsessed with preventing disaster to pave a new way forward. Under their guidance, we will never rebuild the world. We'll stay rooted in place, guarding a horde of technology that can be used for neither good nor evil. Here in Appalachia, we have an opportunity to make a real difference. To help the people of today build their own future. So let's cut free and take that opportunity. Tell me, Initiate. Are you with me? That's not very brotherhood of you. Night Shin might be a dick, but at least he's true. Uh, are you insane? You can't betray the Brotherhood like this. This is not a betrayal, Initiate. Oh, uh, yes, it I is. I believe in the Brotherhood of Steel. So much that I would rewrite its <clears throat> customs to lead it on the right path. Or you could change it from the inside. Contact with the Elders will only shackle us even destroy us so we must disable this transmitter permanently this is a choice that can never be undone so tell me do you support the growth and outreach of the Appalachian Brotherhood of Steel under the command of Paladin Layla Romani or are you beholden to the fearful and outdated mandates of the elders to whom our very own Knight Daniel Shin vows his loyalty this isn't right Uh, let me see. Contacting the elders might destroy us. There's something you're not telling me. Yeah, there's something you're not telling me. Something happened during <clears throat> our journey to Appalachia. A mistake that cost the lives of an entire town. And likely countless more. If Night Shin gets an opportunity to speak with the elders... He will confess to this incident and to us breaking their direct orders. We'll have our title stripped, our influence rendered illegitimate. Everything we worked for here will be gone. But if circumstances prevent us from establishing contact, we will continue on as a sanctioned offshoot of the Brotherhood of Steel. We will be able to spread its authority and goodwill across the nation. Is that not something worth fighting for? Um. Uh, what was this incident? You must recall the Brotherhood weaponry we tasked you with retrieving these last few missions. We had claimed the entire cache from a military facility in the Midwest was meant to stay under Brotherhood protection until we came across a town under threat of a massacre by some raiders. We equipped the townspeople with the weapons and fought by their sides. It was the only way to give them a chance, but it wasn't enough. The raiders won. They took possession of the weapons, and they've been running wild ever since. It is my belief that we must learn from our mistakes but Night Shin hangs on to them he cannot move forward until he confronts the past until he lays our guilt on display for the elders I don't think that's the case that we must move forward on our own that's a pretty extreme point of view though I mean I get that her heart's in the right place but I agree with Night Shin that she's a little extreme uh but what if Night Shin is right? 
there's a thin line between order and blind obedience. I agree. At one time, I may have trusted Shin to stay on the right side. He's always been strict, <clears throat> dedicated, disciplined. But following these events, he became guarded. He doesn't let up for even a second. If he continues on this way, I worry he will lose sight of why he joined the Brotherhood in the first place. Hmm. Uh... I'm ready to make a choice. Consider what's right. Not just for the Brotherhood, but for the people we must protect. Did the game just crash? Maybe if I'm lucky, I can just jump right in exactly where I'm at. Doubt it. No, get out of there. I better not have to do the entire mission all over again. That would be pretty aggravating. But at least we've already talked to her, so I'm ready to make a decision. Like, I like her, man. I like her a lot. Her heart is definitely in the right place, but she's thinking like a regular individual. Not like a Brotherhood member, in my opinion. Ugh. I can't believe this is starting to be a civil war situation. All right, let's see. We're probably outside of the building. Let me see. Check on Paladin Ramadi. Well, that's unfortunate that I have to go through this place all over again. Hopefully these mole rats don't see me. Alright. So let's go back inside. It shouldn't take too long to load in. In theory, of course. But luckily, I think we're pretty much right next to her. We just have to go through that one room in the back and just go straight in there and talk to her. So it should be pretty quick. Again, it just sucks. This is the second time it bugged out, basically. I mean, it's not surprising. It is Fallout 76. But, oh well. It is what it is. So let's go talk to Paladin Ramadi. Why am I overweight? I don't know. I need to stop eating. I'm going to take out my gun just in case one of them doesn't like my answer. Paladin, Paladin Ramadi, I got to talk to you. I believe in the Brotherhood of Steel. So yes. I Re-establishing contact. Yes. This is a choice. That can, yes. Do you support the growth and, or are you beholden? All right. Uh. Night Shin understands something you don't. I stand with him. I'm sad to hear you say that. But if that is your stance, then so be it. I cannot allow I hate the misguided this. beliefs of one initiate to determine the future of Appalachia. This is the only way forward. Am I going to have to fight her? I'm going to have to arre arrest her, don't I? Or aren't I? No! Oh my god! What did oh. she do? To a new brotherhood. What have you done, Paladin? The elders have no hold on us anymore. Oh my god. Stand with me, Shin. Play a part in forging a better future. I have every intention of forging a better future. But this is not the way. You've broken your oath, Paladin. No. That title no longer belongs to you. I agree. With your link removed from the chain, I am the highest ranking officer present. All members of the Appalachian Brotherhood of Steel now answer to me. Well, I can't believe her. To follow you. Authority is given to a leader by those who support them. The same initiates who turn away from you in fear. And I've done wrong by them. 
I never thought I would be in a position to ask for their loyalty. The Brotherhood must stand united. You've severed everything we rely on. I have not turned my back on the Brotherhood, Shin. On the contrary, I will work harder than ever before to lead us forward. It's an emergency <laughs> alert from Port Atlas. Oh no. An alert? There could very well be an attack. We need to get back to the Initiates. I don't take orders from you anymore. Neither do the Initiates. We cannot have them confused on who to follow. Don't you see that protecting them is more important right now? You and I will both return to the fort and deal with the alert. We can settle our dispute later. This is a little more, to be fair, as than a dispute. Say, but as far as I'm concerned, this is already settled. This way, Initiate. Despite the circumstances, the Brotherhood needs us. That was insane. I'm pretty sure this is the last mission. So we are we good are we going straight there? Oathbreaker. Oh my god. 40 damn okay, power attacking. That Let me see. Where's the Oathbreaker? Right there. Uh reduce targets damage output by 20 so it's suppressors. Plus 40% damage, uh, power attack damage, uh, less damage while power attacking. Dude, this is like a straight strength weapon. I'm going to have to drop some uh, laser rifles though. Because I'm over encumbered by a lot. So let's drop that. 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 Um... The good thing is that I don't think I need very many. Cuz I think I think we are we're pretty good in that department. All right, so Fort Atlas. This has to be the last mission. And if so, that's crazy. I still can't believe Ramadi did that. She literally betrayed the Brotherhood. All because she... I feel like she was on low-key on like a power trip. Alright, well we're here, so what's going on? Scribe Valdez, here I come. <coughs> I wonder what the situation was, man. We got an emergency call. The two people, high leaders, if you will, are going on about an attack. So I'm like, what is going on? Nobody seems to act like there's an attack going on, though. Oh, they're down here. What's going on? Oh, dude, they're all dead. Oh, thank goodness you're here. I don't know how much longer we could hold out without you. Atlas is under attack. These big mutant people blew a hole right through the wall of the substructure and came pouring through. Oh, come on. What is up with this game? We've had... One crash, one freeze, and one drop server. Just today. Oh, uh, oh well. We seem to be at the end of the storyline anyway, so we should be fine regardless. Watch it freeze right here. That would suck. The good thing is that we're already at Fort Atlas, so we should just be able to run straight inside. Bingo. Those old army ranks. The I'm not even in a team anymore. 
I might be in a different server altogether. I'll, as soon as I come inside, I'll probably just join a team. That way I can start building up. Alright, let me see. Teams. Oh, this is the old team I was in. Alright, let's go. Sucks that I'm starting over though, but it's okay though. Let's hear what Scribe Valdez called us back here for. Yes, I know. Oh, thank goodness you're super here. mutants. I don't know how much longer we could hold out without you. Atlas is under attack. These big mutant people blew a hole right through the wall of the substructure and came pouring through. A mutant attack now, of all times. Unbelievable. Scribe, status report. How many hostiles? Where are they now? Dozens of mutants. I couldn't get a good count. We fought them back into the substructure and set up a makeshift barricade. We're holding them below for now, but it's only a matter of time before they break through. Um. Uh, alright. Well, we have to help now. Please, before it's too late. <sighs> Get down there and reinforce that barricade. Shin, I trust you can put your feelings aside and work with me on this? Of course. The safety of our brethren comes first. Well, that's okay. progress. Then let's go. Hurry. I'll be a little late. Can I loot these guys? I'll take that. That. And that. Definitely take that. You know what? I'll take these two. Oh, crap. Never mind. Actually, you know what? Let's drop the laser weapon. Bingo. Because I could use that 10 millimeter submachine gun for now. Hopefully, it pays off. Haven't we been. This is the room that we were in with Scribe Valdez before, huh? Where we did her little test. Has to be. Uh, can I go through this door? Oh yeah, this is just an office. Wait, but there's ammo. I'm definitely gonna need the ammo. I think we're good though. Excuse me. Uh, I'm stuck. There we go. Oh god. Good. Our initiates held. And the barricade still standing. So like to arms. Down. Is this the last of the attackers? Unlikely. Hostiles have been hitting in waves for hours now. Our scouts, the ones who return, reported the tunnels crawling with mutants. Why don't we blow the hole? Kind of attack. This threat won't take care of itself. <laughs> We'll go on the offensive, take the fight to them. We can barely hold a position of strength. Engaging superior numbers head on would be suicide. Uh. Uh. Man, this is a tough decision. Let me see, uh, Night Shin is right, uh, Paladin, we can't hope to kill them all on our own. We need to fight Shin, I think this is probably the better option. We need to fight Shin, we can't stand around waiting to die. You're really buying into this plan? After what she pulled at the transmitter? I mean, I agree with you. Right now we'll just be worn down over time. You should know better, Shin. Clearly the initiate does. I think they would work better together. This is no time for bickering. Look, I think there's a way we can make the plan a success. I have some explosive charges. I was waiting to plant them as our last line of defense, but maybe we can put them to better use. If we go into the tunnels and find their points of entry, we can destroy them and prevent any more mutants from attacking. I, uh, that's a great idea. I suppose that could work. It will work, Shin. We have to take a chance on this. As much as I hate to admit it, I don't see a better option right now. 
Fine. But the initiate will plant the bombs, and I will control the detonator. Scribe Valdez will stay behind and command a barricade, in case we don't make it. Very well, Shen. If that's the price of your cooperation, then I'll pay it. If only to hold our brotherhood together a little longer. A little we'll longer. survive. What? Oh, never mind. We can wait. Here are the bombs. I'll stay here and do what I can for the wounded. All right, so let's go on the offensive. I believe in you. Thank oh. you. Oh, she cut off. So I guess we we're going in to the hole. Oh, this is scary, dude. Is it just All right, it's it's both of them, Ramadi and Shin. Oh god, we're going definitely on the offensive. For Narnia. Where's the... Where's the bomber man? Blow up his hand. There we go. Perfect. I'm coming for you guys. My, my weapon is not going to last. Damn. They're very... Heavily weaponized. Really? That's it? Come on, baby. Would you die already? I wouldn't be surprised if... Oh, God. This guy's a level 100. Let's destroy this guy, too. Man, both of them are level 100. I wish I had a lot more. Is Oathbreaker a two-handed weapon? I think it is. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, baby. Oathbreaker time. Oh, God. Can you guys, like, be nice to me? Let's go. Good stuff. I like Oathbreaker. No. Be nice to me. Man, you don't say. We're all taking fire. Got him. I'll take that. Thank you very much. Get out of here. Dude, I'm on fire right now. For Narnia! These 556 five, rounds are. Oh, hello! Shut up! Get away! Let's go! <laughs> she says it all nonchalant, like, hey, yeah, she's fire. No big deal, we're done. Alright, let me see here. Why, thank you! Oh, crap. Woo, that was close. I want Oathbreaker back on. And I want those caps. Always want more caps. Alright. How many of them could there possibly be, right? What is it? No! Be nice! We're on a roll. Oh, fuck. Be nice! Ow. No! Oh, he's done skis. Thank you very much. Hey, Poochie. Nice of you to join us. How many more are there? Also, who has the freaking minigun? Get away. Dude, they just keep coming. There's so many of them. I'll be taking that ammo, please. Thank you. Alright, where's the rest of them? Romani, I got you. You may be a traitor of the Brotherhood, but... I'm not gonna let you die like this. 
So let's continue on and find out what where we're where we're at. We're doing pretty good in this considering all the situation. I right, reached the enemy's uh entry point. What are they talking about back there? <clears throat> yes. This is it, right? This has to be it. Oh, no. Where is he? Got him. He didn't even see it coming. Oh, God. Oathbreaker! Is Oathbreaker almost dead or broken? Yeah, pretty much. Ah! Come here! Would you die already? Oh, God. Okay, I need to see. Shut up. Get away. How do you block with a broken arm? Alright, one of them's dead. Dunzo. Oh, man, he's not dead yet. Got him. Can you guys, like, chill out for a second? Got him. No, one more. Let's go. Please die. Dude, this dude's level 75. Come on, baby. Alright, I need to go back up. Hiya. Did she run out of ammo? Feels that way. Do I have any grenades whatsoever? Um. Two. No, be nice. Come on, baby. Alright, we need to take out Homeboy. Did you just say, are you done resisting? And shoulders, knees, and toes. Come on, let's go. Please die. We'll accept your compliance. We'll accept your compliance? I need to take out Minigun Man. No. Puny hits. Puny hits? You're dying, bro. Come here, doggy. Man, he's level 100. That dog is powerful. Come on. No. There we go. Yo, this this mission is intense. Oh, I think this is never ending. I think I'm supposed to plant the bombs. Place bomb. Alright, well, I got one of them. I probably could have handled this a long time ago. Run! Come on, baby. This is number two. At least I could just keep going in circles. Oh, God. Alright, there's three right there. That means I'm missing one more. And it's right over here. Oh, no! Get away from me! I ran straight into the enemy. Alright, good. We have all four placed. Now we need to retreat, I'm assuming. Oh, shit! Run! Retreat to a safe distance. I'm glad I have that freaking marsupial mutation. Nice. Let me guess. It says watch the fireworks. That's funny. No! Did we win? Oh, God. Would you stop? Oh, God. Oh, God. No! That sucks. Really bad. I wonder where I'm going to respawn at. Dude, I'm like way at the beginning. Oh! Uh, to return to the surface? 
I mean, I'm pretty much at the exit already. I guess dying was a little beneficial. So let's go ahead and vacate the premises. The question is, where do I go? Do I, do I completely leave? I don't see anybody. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and go outside. Cause something's telling me, hold on, let's just follow this. Twelve? Legit, I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Oh, there they are. There was literally... What the hell, dude? There we go. I didn't have a map marker for them. Mission was a success, and Fort Atlas is safe. Our decisive action drove the enemy from our home, as it has in the past, and will in the future. Maybe now you see the merit of my command, Initiate. Act together without hesitation, and we can win any battle. We survived the attack, but now you need to answer for what you did at the transmitter. It was inexcusable. Uh oh. What happened? You've been at each other's throats since you returned. I should have known something was wrong. Uh, Ramadi destroyed the transmitter. Uh, yeah. She did what now? I destroyed the transmitter. The elders are blind to the good we can do. We need to break free from their influence. You only did this to escape responsibility for that incident. You can't bear to face the judgment of the elders. The elders would have us stand trial for crimes we didn't commit. Your own sense of guilt is blinding you to that. It's clear you can't be reasoned. I don't know why I bother trying. These new mutants are a threat that demands our unity. For now. Enjoy your success while you can, Romani. It won't last forever. So is she still in charge? Do what you will, Shen. Cool your head and come back when you're ready to cooperate. I... I don't know what to say. Paladin Romani has always butted heads with the elders, but cutting ourselves off entirely? And I've never seen Night Shin behave that way toward a superior officer. His rage has taken complete control of his senses. Uh. Uh, Shin is right to be upset. The Brotherhood needs, uh, the Brotherhood needs its structure. Romani closed, uh, a line. Night Shin believes strongly in the Brotherhood the Elders have built. And for good reason. But? It's given order to all our lives. <clears throat> and its mission is critical to the revival of humanity. Still, he fosters an oppressive and isolating mindset. I can't help but wonder if the order will evolve into a detached and selfish one with people like him at the helm. I, it's clear this rift won't heal easily. There's too much animosity between those two now. I still believe that they can come together in the end, though. I plan to do everything I can to make that happen. We've been through a lot. I need some time to think. Ad Victorium Initiate. Until next time. So this is not the end of the mission, then? Definitely felt like it was the last mission. Something I can help you with? The best defense. I don't know, hold on, I gotta see what mission's next. Fragment plasma cutter, nice. Wait, hold on, that was... That was the last mission. It was. It ended in a cliffhanger, that's crazy. Alright, well, I mean, that was a pretty good DLC, man. 
it kind of makes me wonder what's next since it definitely feels like there was a lot more left on the table, you know? I don't know. I really enjoyed this. I don't know how you guys feel, but personally speaking, I really enjoyed this DLC. Let me know down in the comment section if you guys enjoyed it as well.